Alright, what are we looking at? This is the latest unreleased version of the Umico. It's a 58mm automatic WTT tool. Uh, this latest version has a stationary needle to get you better distribution around the edges of the basket. And this has a really wide 58.5mm needle spread. So you get the whole basket fully integrated. The latest version also has for you people that want to spin, got the collar, mm -hmm. but also got the nice little ergonomic handle. This is all 3D printed. Fully 3D printed, except for the screws yeah. and needles. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, then you just you print out whatever base you need for the depth of basket that you have. Yeah, yeah this is the latest one. People have been making suggestions for how to get it smoother or mm -hmm. get the distribution more even, and so trying to just get those last little improvements in. We're just gonna do a quick demo. So you I am a real this. person. Yeah, yeah. So you are a real person, yeah. So yeah. this is your design. Yeah, design to me mm -hmm. Uh yeah. So it's just like a community thing. People want to have an affordable way to do something like the other product. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So uh, but yeah, we're gonna do a quick little demo which is grinding it. I'll put all the everything in the link in the description so you guys can check it out, but Probably take you like a day to 3D print, day of printing, assemble it, all of that. Got to make sure your printer is really well dialed in. So usually what I would do is I would take my nine prong WDT like that and manually do it, but you know there is some skill involved, but you got to figure out how to break and the patterns and everything, the depths. But yeah, maybe you're sleepy in the morning. Yeah, you, just, you just want your coffee, right? So instead, what you can do is so let's like look look at that. That is not nice looking. So you take That's one fine. of these. Yeah, well, we'll take this on the part. Sit on there. Okay. Don't Give it a bunch of turns, at least eight. And you're getting a uh, deep, and you're getting different depths, right? Because yeah, I got two needle lengths, so you're getting deep and a little bit of the top breaking as well. One of them. Look at that. You saw there was a whole entire divot there. Now it's all fixed. It's now level. We'll give it like a little tap. Looks like pretty good. And you just give it a tap and pull your shot. So this is bringing, you know, at least much more consistent repeatability because you just need to stick it on and turn it a bunch of times. Yes. Versus, versus when you're doing a WDT, your hand, like you literally are not going to be as consistent as this is. So. This is giving you a consistency that you know we don't we don't have. You know, you yeah. might, might be hard to learn. You can totally get really consistent mm -hmm. traditional stuff, um, but you, yeah, you have to be really focused and know what you're doing. Yeah. Um, whereas this, it's like mindless. You just give it a bunch of turns, and <laughs> it may not. You can probably do better with a manual tool, um, but you can get the same result every time. Yeah. So that's the advantage of this, and also, um, I think it's really fun. Like this is actually real. Like it feels good to use. Like I mean, it's a it, fidget toy too. Yeah. It only feels good to use, uh, and also you know you get you can customize more, get some cooler colors when you print it out. Yeah, whatever colors you want, match uh, your setup. Uh -huh. But you know how many time, how much, uh, how much time did it take you to make this or like iterate? I mean, this I'm calling this V2, mm -hmm. but this is realistically probably like ten iterations, okay. something like that. Um, yeah, you, you know, easily like a couple months of like development mm -hmm. time getting it to where it is now. Yeah. You know, you're mostly doing this for the community, and it's just cool to, to like. I've been now seeing this more out there, but it's awesome to you know have the guy designed it. Yeah, and, and show it's really fun to meet everybody here and, and talk about it. Yeah, print it out. Show show me all the makes on printable. It's been super fun interaction with you. I want to thank Vincent for uh, showing this off and yeah. be uh, you know, coming out and hanging out. Yeah. Hang out there. Yeah. All right. Well, thanks. They caffeinated. Okay. You know, protecting the needles with these longer lugs here. Yeah, because like for that one, it's kind of hard to aim. Your yeah, if you miss a little, then boom, you just screwed a needle. Yeah, yeah. And you got This oh. is like you can just walk in and, and run it. Yeah, this is PLA. It's all PLA. Yeah, this okay. one. And once you get some better material for this, it'll feel so good, though. Oh, definitely. Because yeah. yeah. even with PLA, it feels pretty good as it is. Yeah, but but you, you know, put something something a little bit more self lubricating. Yeah, be pretty fantastic. That'd be awesome. awesome. I also like that you can you know you can start printing out the cool colors. I want one like purple. Oh, yeah. Or pink, pink, and pink and blue. Pink and blue. And I designed the small knob just because I don't, with, with the, the Moonraker, the ergonomics of twisting your wrist, mm. like kind of flicking it. Yeah. Yeah, because you don't, nice. well, much cause, no, well, because you you lose a stroke. Yeah, yeah, You're only getting like maybe half a turn each time you do that yeah, too. Yeah, you can just do like. And this, yeah, the, you know, with a small little handle, you get this like delicate little stirring motion. Mm -hmm. I kind of wanted to 
be, I want it to be inspired by like you know the motion that you have when you're doing traditional WDT with, with these little tools. Like yeah, this is much, it's much this much delicate much. little feel, and I kind of wanted to emulate that with the. Oh, that's the why you yeah. That's, that's why you made this so small. Yeah. So you ordered? Can I order it already? <laughs> <laughs> the files are available for free. What? The, the, the files are available for free. Cool. Maybe be able to order sometime soon, but. So, so I, like, where can I find the files? If you go to printables.com, print yeah, and you search the Umicoat, U M 